real quick, uh, like, reaction to the debate. Uh, I think Obama killed it. You know, uh, he, like, you know, the analysis go at him, it's a town hall format, he can't really be that aggressive. It seemed to me like the crowd was almost an afterthought. It, he, every question, he just turned to Mitt Romney, he's like, okay, you know, I'll answer your question, but this guy right here, you know, this guy, you know, yep. I, I loved it, you know, he does a spoon. To me, the moment that stuck out where it was just, Clearly, just you know, he won it, and even Ch- Charles Krauthammer, you know, the, the reanimated corpse, said that uh, Obama won. And to me, the moment was Libya when yes. he stood up there and he looked at Romney. You could see the look on his face; it was like he was talking to his child. And how he said, "You don't politicize something like this." In fact, it Sean, was, we it, got that. At that cl- moment, we got that clip right now. Hold on. We're going to play it right now. This is uh, clip okay. number three. This is when I think Obama really, I, I think he got, this is where I think he actually got angry and was like, the, you know, yeah. this is where I it's think a, he basically, it, the it, subtext it, it, of this is like, Mitt it, Romney, you're a piece of garbage. Here it is. The day after the attack, Governor, I stood in the Rose Garden and I told the American people in the world that we are going to find out exactly what happened, that this was an act of terror. And I also said that we're going to hunt down those who committed this crime. And then a few days later, I was there greeting the caskets coming into Andrews Air Force Base and grieving with the families. And the suggestion that anybody in my team, whether the Secretary of State, our UN ambassador, Anybody on my team would play politics or mislead when we've lost four of our own governor is offensive. That's not what we do. That's not what I do as president. That's not what I do as commander in chief. I mean, it, you, you just get the sense in that room that um, the, he was he was, you know, very forceful. And, you know, that works on a bunch of different levels. One, it reminds people that's mm-hmm. exactly what Romney did. He played politics with it yeah. uh, almost immediately. And also, the subtext there is, now go on and tell us about how I apologize for things. You know, uh, that's, that's, you know that's, that's the, uh, I, yeah, I agree. I think that was, uh, and, and remember, in, in, next, in week, that, next week uh, is the foreign policy debate, and so that's going to carry exactly. over. Like, and, and to me, in that moment, he made Romney and the right-wing echo chamber look so small. They looked so petty in that moment. And it just punctuated when Candy Crowley corrected him on that. It was just, it, the audience erupted in cheering. I, it, it, to me, it was just, and, and Mitt Romney didn't challenge it. He, he just slinked away, he lowered his head, slinked away right back and sat back down and, and, and to shut up. It was, it was unbelievable. Well, you Sean, know, I just, I was like, it's over. Yeah, I think yeah. you're right about that, Sean.